Okay guys, I got my game face on. I'm headed out the door. It's Ulta day, finally! Okay, so there's something wrong with this phone. It stops recording after, it just makes me so mad. Anyway, um, I was trying to record the big day get ready with me, right? And the phone stops like somewhere, I don't even know where, but it may have been like putting on my lipstick. I don't know. Anyway, then it was like everything I tried to do. So like it's 946. I wanted to be at the Ulta like at eight o'clock, two hours prior to opening. So I knew I was going to be the first one in that door. I was going to camp, you know, make a whole funny video about how um, I'm like sitting on the <laughs> sidewalk outside the door waiting on them to open. You know, it's going to be really funny. And uh, no, everything you can think of has happened this morning. It's like, I don't know. Am I not supposed to be going over here to the Ulta? Anyway, so then I finally go to leave and I don't have my glasses. Oh, I can't, I can't read anything without my glasses. So I run back in and I get my glasses. And then my neighbor across the street, she's like, she's having a garage sale. And so, like, there's cars blocking me in my driveway. I can't pull out. <sighs> so, I'm like, I mean, because they're lying down because she's got a yard full. When she has a garage sale, she has a garage sale now. She's got a, her yard is, like, full of stuff. And people are lined up both sides of the street to go to or see what's at the garage sale. And I'm like, I gotta go. You guys, you're going to make me late. I'm, now it is 9.48. Oh my gosh. I have this vision. <laughs> I have this vision of like people lined out the door to get into this store and I'm not going to be the first one. That's what's going to happen, isn't it? Okay, I'm going to shut you off until I get there. You would not believe the crap. Oh, do you see those people? They're out there putting signs that says Ulta now open. You are not going to believe the crap that I just pulled that light <laughs> to get through it. I mean, I didn't do anything legal, but let's just say I accelerated to get in front of an ambulance. <laughs> okay. It looks like it's going to pour rain. There it is. Do you see the Alta over there? Okay. The shopping plaza is starting to fill up in front of the Alta. Seatbelt off. <laughs> There's already a lady standing outside the door. Does she not know this privilege is mine? Do you see her? No. I will fight her. <laughs> okay, maybe I'm going to be number two. Yeah. Yeah. You are our first customers here in Greenwood. Come on in and welcome to Alta. Are there any good so spending? Clean one looks like. I've had requests for that. They want to see an Alta Ladies. since nobody's been in it. Ladies, we can't take pictures in the store. We can't take pictures in the store. Well, you have to have sometimes I forget that I'm like, when I'm snapping, that I'm not actually taking video for my channel. <laughs> So I just put a whole bunch of stuff on Snapchat, and I guess I'll have to try and download it for my video, but there's Alta. So say bye. So I'm going to go home now and film everything that I bought. Hopefully I won't have to take anything back. Okay, that's a good way to get a ticket. I decided to just go ahead and talk about it on, on the car ride to get my mail because I don't want to download all those Snapchats. <laughs> so if you follow me on Snapchat, this is a repeat. So basically, um, I got there. There was one woman who was there and um, then a bunch more showed up after me. And the owner, he's like, got his little orange shirt on, and he's like in the parking lot, just proud as he can be, because all these people are at the altar the first day. I would be too, 
You know, I mean, if, that, if I had an altar store and I saw on the first day all these people, especially since they made no kind of a big deal advertising that this store was going to open. I mean, if you didn't drive by it, you just didn't know. So, uh, yeah, he's, he's real proud that all these people are out there and everything. But they give you no, no big deal, okay? I mean, in fact... I don't remember if I said this already or if I said it in the Snapchat. I get so confused when I'm snapping and when I'm filming. <laughs> but, um, yeah, grand opening. So today's the first day they open their doors. To me, that is grand opening. But in Ulta speak, that's next Friday. Yeah, this is a soft opening. What the heck? Whatever. <laughs> I did get a free trial size there reel, which that makes about three I have of that now. <laughs> but oh well. Um, yeah, so what else? Oh yeah, so um, you probably already saw, or I will put in this video somewhere, the woman opening the doors. That woman opening the doors, she must be like the big manager of the store, right? Because she is the one that you'll hear going ladies ladies she's talking to me <laughs> she's not she just doesn't want to go you know um hey you with the camera or whatever i'm the only one in there filming <laughs> okay we've already established out front that i am a bit of a weirdo because i am snapping about the opening and stuff and so Anyway, she starts off with the ladies, ladies, all at first. She's talking to me, you know, and comes over and tells me that I have to put the camera away. That I can't, um, unless I have a letter from corporate that allows me to film, which I didn't think to do, but I guess I could have tried, that I can't do that. Um, but honey, yeah, you should see me in there with the samples because they've never been touched. Okay, so yeah, I felt really comfortable slapping crap on me because nobody's ever touched it but me. Um, so yeah, uh, so I went through all the aisles of the store, naturally forgot what I went in there for, so I had to look at my shopping cart of my Ulta app, and so they're following me around because I have the phone out, right, and they want to make sure that I'm not filming, and I'm not. All I'm doing is checking my Ulta app, but you know, they're nonchalantly coming up. You know, they, they can't, what are they gonna do? Say, give me your phone or, you know. But seriously, you know, they're buttering me up. They're, they're just trying to, to have conversation with me to make sure that I'm not filming, I think. So, you know, oh, your hair is amazing. Oh, your eyeshadow is so beautiful. How did you get your lipstick like that? What foundation do you wear? Oh, la, 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 you, because I'm the most beautiful woman in the whole world and everyone wants to know what I do. I don't believe that. Here's what the truth is. The truth is <laughs> they wanted to make sure that I wasn't filming anything. So they're going to keep me engaged the whole time. They're not following anybody else around the store. And I'm not the most beautiful woman in the world, although I was the only woman in there with makeup on. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go get my mail. I'll see you guys. Hey guys, I am back, and I look like I have been ravaged. I had to stop at the Kroger and build a salad and pick up this. Have you guys ever had this? This is good. Mmm. It tastes like coffee. Why am I talking? Look at the protein in it. First, I want to say thank you to my anonymous angel, whoever you are, uh, for the uh, gift card for my Ulta for my Ulta grand opening. <laughs> Do I, I get the best summies in the whole world? I love you. If you're new to my channel, welcome here. And if you are an existing subby. Thank you for sticking around. I love you. These are swatches from the Alta. <laughs> um, I'm not dirty. Uh, no. And thank you so much to my anonymous angel who made almost all of this possible. Um, okay, so first thing out of the box is a Revlon diffuser. 
Uh, Kristen Game has been talking about how she does her hair with this diffuser. And um, I have a Numi hair dryer that is like pink and black zebra that I got a couple of years ago on their site. Um, it was a special. So um, anyway, so I asked them about their diffuser on their website and they said it would not fit their own hair dryer. It fits their regular hair dryer, but it won't fit my hair dryer. So Ulta says I can bring this back if it doesn't work. Um, I'm going. I want to give this a try and see if that helps my curly, kinky mess not be fizzy after I wash my hair. Um, okay, what's the next thing I pull out? Tarts, lights, camera, lashes with a their primer. So you know, you know I'm on the hunt trying to figure out who can actually beat my Sills Booster XL. And, all right, this is free. Um, they're real mascara. I've got like three of these now. My good friend and um, yes, my wonderful, beautiful, good friend Mandy Jo here. She was did a video on this. And, uh, I'll try and link that below and she was showing how to use this and it there is a salmon color in here so I'm gonna give this a try it's by NYX and it's a corrective palette and it's supposed to be pretty good I was out of my big sexy hair powder so I picked that up um, I want to save this for last don't peek Okay, that's all that's in that bag. All right, then I picked, I was out of the Evergrey um, spray that I use in between my hair colorings. People have been raving about this and I wanna try it. It's the Nivea for extra dry skin in the shower lotion, body wash lotion thing. A NYX eyelash primer. Told you. I am determined to see if Sills Bister XL is actually the best one or not. So if you have one that you like and you want me to review that, send it to me. Because <laughs> I'm not gonna buy anymore. Uh, I looked for the elf and can't find it. Got this. I'm almost out of my makeup wipe removers. I have Bird's Bees and the Cucumber Sage. It's gonna be in my empties, but I don't like that. I don't like the smell of it. So I thought I would try this pink grapefruit one. And then I got three masks. So they're from a company called I'm Real. So it's an aloe vera, a red wine mask that's supposed to be good for your pores. Um, the aloe vera one is a, they're all sheet masks, moisturizing. And then the avocado one is for nutrition. And these were $3.50 each, which is half the price of the sheet masks I get at Sephora. So uh, we'll see whether or not those are any good. And so then my last two, which everybody knew I was saving money for, was the Lorac Pro um contour palette and the Lorac Pro Metal palette. And I almost grabbed that matte one. And then I thought, no, think about what you're doing here. You have the Kat Von D contour palette for your eyes. You do not need that. There's I just cannot between the Kat Von D um, contour palette and the Too Faced Natural Matte Palette. There is no need for the Lorac um, Matte Palette. Okay, so that's it. I'm gonna go eat my salad from the salad bar. And so, if you guys are having a great day, please go on and be a blessing to somebody else. was on.
my lips are coming off. I would eat and then make it. If you ever wonder what you can do with your used Ultra bags, this makes a nice bib. I'm gonna put this bib on for when I eat my salad because I'm messy. <laughs> <laughs>